Hello friends, welcome back, hearty welcome to you. In this session, let us see how to find out angle between a pair of straight lines. Let us say that ax square plus 2hxy plus by square, which is a second degree homogeneous equation, represents a pair of straight line. Now we want to find out the angle between these two lines in terms of a, b and h. First let's write down the formula then we will see how we can derive that. The formula is given by cos theta equal to a plus b absolute value of that by square root of a minus b whole square plus 4h square. I can also write down tan theta equal to 2 into root of h square minus a b divided by a plus b. So, let us see how we can derive this. To derive what we will do? We will say that a x square plus 2 h x y plus b y square which represents a pair of straight lines. So, let us say that let that straight lines be one is L 1 x plus M 1 y another is L 2 x plus M 2 y. Now, that is a combined equation. We know both of them represent the same. So, we can go back and compare the quotients. We can write down L 1 L 2 is equal to A. We can also write down L 1 into M 2 plus L 2 into M 1 is what quotient of x y term. So, I can say L 1 M 2 plus L 2 M 1 is equal to 2 H also M 1 M 2 is equal to B. Now, we this is what the relation we are able to understand by comparing the given equation to two lines L 1 x plus M 1 y and L 2 x plus M 2 y. Now, we know that if A 1 x plus B 1 y plus C 1 equal to 0 is one line, another line is A 2 x plus B 2 y plus C 2 equal to 0, then the angle between them is given by two ways. One I can say cos theta is equal to a 1 a 2 plus b 1 b 2 divided by square root of a 1 square plus b 1 square multiply that with square root of a 2 square plus b 2 square. Other way I can say is tan theta equal to a 1 b 2 minus a 2 b 1 divided by a 1 a 2 plus b 1 b 2. Now, if we compare this to with whatever the lines we have a 1 is equal to L 1, B 1 is equal to M 1, A 2 equal to L 2 and B 2 equal to M 2. So, let us try to write down what is tan theta or cos theta, any one of them we can take, we will take tan theta so that it is easy. According to that formula, whatever we learned just now, we know tan theta is equal to a 1 b 2 minus a 2 b 1 this is my a 1 and this is b 1 a 2 and b 2 a 1 b 2 minus a 2 b 1 that is l 1 m 2 minus l 2 m 1 divided by l 1 divided by we have a 1 a 2 plus b 1 b 2 that is l 1 l 2 plus m 1 m 2 this is tan theta. Now, we know L 1 L 2 is equal to A, we are pretty happy with that. We know M 1 M 2 equal to B, we are okay happy with that. But what about this L 1 M 2 minus L 2 M 1?
how to write it in the known way we know l1 m2 plus l2 m1 is 2 h but how to write the l1 m2 minus l2 m1 for that what we will do so let us say suppose this is a and this is b a minus b equal to square root of a plus b whole square minus 4ab we can leverage that formula let me write it down what i mean i mean that a minus b whole square a minus b whole square is equal to a plus b whole square minus 4ab so can i say a minus b equal to square root of a plus b whole square minus 4ab now a is l1 m2 b is l2 m1 what we need is minus but what we have is plus so i can write down a minus b l1 m2 minus l2 m1 equal to l1 m2 plus l2 m1 whole square minus of 4 into l1 a is l1 m2 and b is l2 m1 so i can multiply them and i can write that so that will be equal to l1 m2 plus l2 m1 whole square minus 4 l1 l2 m1 m2 i have square root divided by l1 l2 plus m1 m2 this is nothing but equal to l1 m2 plus l2 m1 is 2 h can i say 4 h square minus square root of 4 h square minus 4 into l1 l2 into m1 m2 is nothing but a into b so i can say 4ab divided by l1 l2 plus m1 m2 which is nothing but equal to a plus b so that's equal to if we simplify that is equal to 2 root h square minus ab divided by a plus b Two root h square minus a b by a plus b. So once we know tan theta, we can easily find out cos theta. Let us see how to do that. We'll finish it in one minute. We know that we just found out that tan theta equal to two root h square minus a b by a plus b. We have to find out cos theta. For that, we'll just go to trigonometry. We'll take a small triangle. We know this is angle theta. Tan is opposite by adjacent. Can I say two root h square minus a b here and a plus b? here we need to find out what's that value pythagoras theorem we can do let us say that is h for us let us say this is h i can say h square equal to a plus b whole square plus 4 into h square minus ab which is nothing but equal to a plus b whole square minus 4ab plus 4h square which is equal to a minus b whole square plus 4h square i have to take square root of this so i will write down square root of this is a minus b whole square plus 4h square so now we take cos theta we will have a plus b by a minus b whole square plus 4h square so let us do one simple problem based on this let us take a simple example we have to find out the angle between the pair of straight lines given by y square minus xy minus 6x square which is nothing but a second degree homogeneous equation so let me just write it down in the standard way a x square minus 6x square plus 2hxy minus xy plus by square plus y square equal to 0 let's compare this to standard equation find out values we know a equal to minus 6 2h equal to minus 1 and b equal to 1 want to find out the angle between them so i can go for either cos theta or tan theta let's go for tan theta and see tan theta equal to 2 into square root of h square minus ab 
h is minus 1 by 2 so h square is 1 by 4 minus a into b is minus 6 divided by absolute value of a plus b that is nothing but minus 6 plus 1 and remember whenever we have two straight lines angle between them there will be one acute angle and another obtuse angle we are only talking about the acute angle here by taking the positive value okay right now let's simplify this this is nothing but 2 into square root of 1 by 4 plus 6 divided by absolute value of minus 5 is 5 or can I say 2 into 2 by 5 into square root of square root of 1 plus 24 by 4 which is equal to 2 by 5 into 5 by 2 which is equal to 1 tan theta equal to 1 tells me theta equal to 45 degrees so the angle between a pair of straight lines given by y square minus xy minus 6x square is 45 degrees so in this session we understood how to find out the angle between pair of straight lines in case of second degree homogeneous equation it's of the form ax square plus 2hxy plus by square equal to 0 then the angle between them is given by if the angle is theta then tangent of the angle or tan theta equal to 2 into root of h square minus ab divided by a plus b or cos theta equal to absolute value of a plus b divided by square root of a minus b whole square plus 4 h square 